They see me crashing. Cause shit's crashing. fucked. <laughs> okay, so I should suppose I should listen uh -oh. in on you, or should I talk with the rabbit? Nope, Actually, I don't I, see the um, rabbit. Bad news. Oh nope. Uh, I'm in. I'm low. Uh, What's happening? Uh, okay, the quick save just lasted for. I think we're all good now. I think it's because yeah. he tried to save while people were joining, which yeah. was all of us. There was some shit that happened there. Okay, the yeah, so I had assigned party kiss. party members. Okay, I'm gonna try and talk to the Restless Scarecrow again. Okay. Oh yeah, he does address you by name. Okay, so Red Prince, greatest of the royals, greatest of the kings to be. Do stay with me here for a while. Take a rest from the weary road. A great pounding suddenly erupts in your chest. Your inner god roars and bellows, an incoherent, maddening cacophony. Oh, sounds like a trap. Uh oh, trap. It is awful how she treats you. She asks so much and gives so little in return. Uh? Ask who you're speaking to. I am the only one who cares. She will say otherwise. She always does. And in the end, she'll betray you. Don't play her game. Think of yourself. Rest here. The sun is golden. No one will bother you. This moment can last forever. If you let it. A sudden weariness washes over, bone deep and as irresistible as a strong current. Bite down on the side of your tongue hard, jolt yourself awake. The fatigue ebbs away, then surges back. Shh, don't fight it. This is how it's supposed to be. Sleep now. When you wake, it will be in a new world, a beautiful world. I kind of want us to come just to see what happens. But then you might die. It's fine. If he dies, we'll just resurrect him. Whee! Your legs buckle, then ease you downwards. Beneath warm golden crops is dark, damp soil and bones. Bones of others who laid down to rest and never rose up again. You lie in the darkness and join them. <gasps> oh, That's he actually died. Dead. Instant death. He actually and, died. And now there's, there's enchanted scarecrows so coming up out of the corpses? Wanna, we need to fight the, the scarecrows. That's funny. Yeah, I, I think if I resist, we still fight the scarecrows. Hopefully. We, we, we just leave Wander to his fate, and then we're like, oh, <laughs> contest is three now. He'd close the server. Yeah, I mean, you have to realize you'd have to coax the save file out of me, which would be a pretty hard uh, sell. <laughs> nah. Nah. Yeah. Nah, if I was like, just give me the save file and we never have to talk again, you'd be like, fuck, I didn't know, I didn't do, know it was right? that easy. <laughs> you know what i do, right? I, I just switch you... to a solo series and just play it by myself. It's like, nope, they're gonna, they're gonna try and strong arm me off of this. Let's uh, do the reverse. Okay, anyway. You guys ready? That is oh the yeah, you should probably get close. That is the <laughs> downside of this entire premise, is the idea that, like it's almost impossible to have a group of friends together for the game this big and long, and then also be like, oh yeah, but you can totally betray each other in the story. Yeah, I don't like that. I like, really... Like, how, how that works structurally ever is bizarre. The only way I'm okay with the betrayal is if it's at the very end, we have a four-way showdown, cas Castle Crasher style, and then the game ends with whatever that ending is. It'll still or suck and be boring. we can all mutually decide to become a new set of gods. I Yeah, I don't know what the options are, but if it's like, if it forces us to betray each other, it better fucking be at the very end of the game, otherwise it's gonna be real bad. Alright, uh, we good? Yeah. Resist! Yeah. <sighs> I only wanted to give you rest, not pain. Now, I leave you to my children. They are many. They are impatient. They lack my gentle touch. Oh. I am sorry. Truly. Right. There's five of them. <laughs> but some of them are pretty far away. Yeah, they're level 12. Whoa, oh, shit. Whoa. <laughs> okay. How, how, whoa. How can people allow these enchanted scarecrow things to exist? These are all level 12. By I think making we're gonna die them? Again. And he just drained yeah. your source. <laughs> Grimoire, you're, 
your enemies are more powerful than you consider fleeing. Uh, yeah, we could just run. Do we want to just run? I can't even control we my character. Probably it's should FYI. run. FYI. What do you mean you can't control your character? I'll see if I can I bless a, you on I my I have turn. a skill that makes it so that I can't run away or control my character. Oh. I mean, uh, a status effect. Oh, that doesn't look good. That then is bad. Then what are we supposed to do? Just abandon just bird to, to his run? fate. <laughs> uh, yeah. If I die, just resurrect me out of the fight and run away. What Whoa. the fuck? I'll see what that is. Bone what Widow. the hell is that? Bone it's Widow. It's a Bone Widow. Apparently it is just a giant black <laughs> widow spider. Made Spooder. out of bones. That's the important part. He didn't mention. Bone Widow spider. Holy shit. Wait, I didn't thing. want to go there. Terrified, uh, blocked by magic armor. <laughs> I suppose it can Please. burrow, surprise enemies by emerging underground, and devour a fresh corpse to restore your vitality. So this thing can eat corpses to what? revive itself. Really? That's stupid. Um... Hmm. Oh, my bone widow is terrified. Hello. Hi. We're, we're in a convenient AoE range now. Is that what you no, wanted not. to do? No. Not what I, that's what I wanted to do. I think we're out of our league. Oh here. my god. Whoa. They're higher level than us, and there's more of them than us. We shouldn't keep going north. Apparently, it ends holy in bad. shit. Do you want me to just reload us? Yes, to before? reload us, and we can talk with the rabbit and then leave. Or we could just not talk with. Oh, yeah. I thought you were going to say the rat. I was going to be the like, rabbit. why? We already talked to the rat. Rabbit. Okay, so this is before I even started talking. We have to become stronger before Jesus, we the level these guys. curve. <laughs> yeah. I, apparently, this whole area is open world. We can go wherever we want, do whatever we want. And but, we chose uh, wrong. <laughs> yeah. You can uh, go wherever you want, asterisk. <laughs> apparently, it's heavily level locked. So Jesus. But if All it's right, level time, locked... Time to carefully would... hover over every character we interact with to see what level they are before we talk well, to them. Well, uh, the suggestion is the most easily accessible thing for us right now is the Driftwood Arena, which I like the idea of that. Oh, an arena? Less fight... talking, more just fighting people. I can hit bird? Uh, Did... I mean, you can hit bird whenever you want. No, It'll he... just cost you a plane ticket. <laughs> and a dog. All right, so <laughs> I'm next to the doe rabbit. I'm gonna find, talk to the rabbit. Ah, they so they actually call them bucks and does, like yep. deer. Yep. Saying, no rabbit. Oh, that He's portrait's like, very cute. He's like, ugh, mating season again. If I have to deal with one more buck looking to court me, I'll take a chunk out of his ear. <laughs> that was it. Just complaining Aww. about boys. <laughs> yep. Ah, uh, boys. Yeah, she's, gonna, she's gonna bite their ears off. So I want to test whether or not I can talk to people with this hood on. You oh. might want a quick save, actually. I have quick saves. I'm gonna try oh. Fingal Boyd here and see if they attack me. I bet you're the musical sort. You've thought about taking up the loot. I got a few ready to go, all freshly strung. What? That's going all right. Oh yeah. By the way, uh, they will automatically attack you if they think you're undead. Yeah, so I think the like match just might be working, go. even though it's just a hood. Yep. I actually have an undead option, weirdly enough. <laughs> people want to listen in to this music oh, conversation? Sure. Yep. I'm doing. I bet you're the musical sort. You ever think about taking up the loot? I got a few ready for you, all freshly strung. Tell her that mu indeed music is one of the last few remaining pleasures remaining to you. She gives you an odd sideways look, then shakes her head and beams beatifically. Oh. Wonderful. It's like I always said. Everyone's got a melody in them. You just gotta look. My brother Laszlo couldn't carry a tune in a bucket when he were away thing. Now he's got the voice of an angel. Laszlo, I met your brother at Fort Joy. He's oh. He's all right then, yeah. Huh. I guess he must have not died because telling saying that's not an option. Oh. I don't, do you, does anyone remember Laszlo? 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I talked with him. He was the bard that was in the um the one of the tents, and he listened to one of my stories about the elves. Oh and yeah, he was very happy. Oh, so he's okay. He's a sprightly one. That's last lot, all right. If he had the blues, you'd never know it. Nothing kept his big smile from brightening in the darkness. I hate the Magisters for what they've done. Stole me brother. Stole me heart. I keep going, though. Hoping to get to Ark sooner than later. Lucian's day crowds will be wanting some musical trifles. I love this dick move right here. You saw anything more, uh, useful? Useful? Ah. You mean deadly. Used to make bows and fletch arrows, but left that hobby behind. Uh, what would Lassler do in your position? Let the magisters walk all over him, or fight to help help other sorcerers? Oh. <laughs> oh, I ain't taking that guilt trip. I ain't gonna stop your rowdy ways, but I ain't gonna help you either. If you wanna make music instead of war, I'll be around. <laughs> I mean, this see year's if... her portrait looks weirdly unfinished. I ain't gonna take to your rowdy ways. <laughs> I'm gonna see if I can talk to her. Actually, she might be able okay. to. I might be able to convince her. Well, you. Yeah, I've got a very high persuasion because I kind of decided screw all the other skills. Wait, what? What happened to all the chickens, bird? Did you what? do this? Oh, the chickens are all dead. How? Oh, oh sorry. Oh, Peeper I'm... woke up and killed them all. Wait, Peeper's what? the only remaining chicken. Yeah, I there's Peeper. Peeper I'm woke sorry up to I kill accused everything. you, bird. Because, <laughs> no, it's fine. Uh, I would have done the same thing. What are you, some kind by. of catcher of birds? Let's let's listen to. Well, well. Okay. Now we're split conversations. Oh, oh Here, gosh. Give me a second. We got an achievement called Proud Parent. <laughs> Mama. Look, it is it is a pitch black chicken. It's evil. He's, he's like Mama. Not the mama. Oh, oh no. Okay, then. It killed the shit out of all of them. Oh, wait, is it yours he now? It's following you now, isn't it? Oh, no, you gained a chicken summon. Oh, my God, you have a chicken familiar. The chicken mama! familiar will eventually become your... your. You'll be able to summon it yeah. in fights, and it's you a void to, woken chicken. You have to keep it alive oh. so you can get a void woken chicken. Wait, is this true? Can I actually keep it? I mean, that's what happened with the cat. That's all we have to go on. Yeah. It's just following you now, like the cat that became bird summon. Oh, it's so cute cat, in a terrible uh, bird, way. Do you always have that summon, or is that a memory skill? I believe it's a memory skill. Let me check. Like, do you have yeah, to take? No, it, it costs memory. Okay. Really? Do you have innate skills? No. Oh, so on the. Uh, I do. I have my source skill, but that's it. Yeah, you I know, have time guys, warp and play dead. It actually crossed my mind that this would happen. And, and why did you say anything? App apparently, um, that might actually be a summon for you. Ow, what? why? Yeah, yeah, that's what we're trying to figure out. I, according to people, you do get a summon around here. So, well, this, I believe that might it. be it. A dark I mean, chicken? Yeah, let's try to keep it yeah. alive again. Just like last time. It was easy to keep the cat alive, so... Yeah, I mean, what, could a, have. what could a chicken possibly do? It has a hundred and forty five miles. pretty damn useless, so I imagine the chicken's probably gonna not be all that much better. Shoot lasers? Okay! Watch it, watch it turn into, like, a mega monster. I mean, the cat takes like, driftwood. I mean, the cat Dick takes Zilla. hits for you and helps you teleport. You put, I said the cat is useless. You're bad for I'm cat self-esteem. This, okay. this is why Skidder's trying to revolt from our D&D campaign. I'm negging the cat, Keith. Stop negging your inanimate hey. creature that's not real. They're not gonna read this poem. For it's even written in papyrus. <laughs> Was there really a papyrus poem? You can talk to- ooh, talk to the bulls. Tell me what the bulls say. Okay, so we got a market here. It's cheaping! Oh. This guy- this guy sells a chicken claw skill book. Ooh! A chicken claw? Oddly relevant. <laughs> oh! Will this turn into a, a mega, like, killer chicken? Hey, by the way, this guy sells an amazing wand. Plus one intelligence, single-handed initiative, and lifesteal. Oh, hmm. chicken chicken claw is a polymorph skill. Oh, yeah. I it's see. It's what turns an enemy into a chicken. Yeah, I've had that. It's okay. Yeah, wa uh, oh. bird might want to check this vendor for arrow thurge spells. Okay. Ooh, artillery plant. Yeah. There it is. 
Yeah, this guy sells artillery plant. And fire slug. Ooh, fire slug. That sounds like my kind of thing. Summon a fire slug, pyrokinetic three. Yeah, I could get artillery plant, but it costs two thousand. Oh, I do have two thousand gold. Yeah, not so uh, not so bad anymore. I still think it's weird that I have an evil chicken following me. It's not evil, it's misunderstood. <laughs> it's it just killed a, all the other chickens. Maybe the hatching caused like a brain spike that wiped them all out at once. <laughs> yeah, you don't, you don't know if he, maybe you don't know if he literally killed the other chickens. Yeah, maybe they communally decided to sacrifice themselves <laughs> yep, yep. for the sake of uh, making this chicken stronger. It's in fact the sum total of all of the chickens <laughs> there. So many spells. Not much. People don't want to leave town. Can't blame them. There's no safety in solitude. Alrighty, any good Will arrow surge? Oh, good. The dupe, ch uh, the dupe glitch is done. Enough. I will have to come back here and do some horrible things. Uh, where's the pyromancy person? Was it Ovis? This yeah, it was book Ovis. man it has lots of books. <laughs> Many of which you Ew. can see, visibly. Supposedly they've been having a real fishing problem. There's oh, I could probably steal with... those ones that are just sitting there on the counter. Flaking scales. That was, like, sneaky enough. Right now Beamers. it's, like, broad daylight. Bree oh, heads. uh, by the way, Trader Bree sells hydromancy, uh, necromancy, and summoning. Oh. Yep. These are important things so, to find. She's the one you guys probably want to look into. Soon I will have every spell. There are way more spells than the wiki yeah. made it look like when, when we were like, re researching our classes. She sells Door to Eternity, uh, which is a skill for you, Keith. You needing supplies? It's stuck up if I were you. It's stuck up if I were you. Never seen the only thing like that this. I can buy from this vendor that seems even kind of interesting is that I can never swap with anybody now. Ooh. So I can flip uh, the position of two characters, including myself. Wait, That's Dominate that. Mind is a summoning skill? <laughs> Apparently. Make somebody join yeah, your know. team? So basically I can cat swap with anybody if I buy this thing. I but it's also a thousand gold, which seems kind of expensive. It's not really. Uh, oh. As long as you let me know between sessions, I can always get you more gold. I can infuse huh. my I can infuse my summon with stealth powers too now. Might as well learn the skill then. Soulmate. Why not? Could be fun. What were you sneaking for? Oh no, I'm just doing it because the animation is funny. It makes my character head bob. There are Apparently so you can many do summoning some really spells. Really funny things with uh, you can do some funny things with uh, pickpocket in this game. I'm just short. Ooh, chain lightning looks fun. Yeah, but it costs a source point. Y yeah, I mean, I don't really have a lot of those. I only have one. If I had. 800 gold, I could just get every summoning skill. <laughs> we have the gold to spare, you want my 800 gold? That's all I'm short by, and then I just have every summoning skill available. <laughs> you want it? I can make that happen. Full customization, I'll go for it. There you go, I gave you 1800. Boom, I get to click on everything. <laughs> so much clicking. Later, then. Oh my oh, god, I can learn a spell. Yeah? I can learn a spell called Laser Ray. Oh. Oh no, don't uh, learn that spell, please. I am... I am going to learn Laser Ray. There goes 5,000 gold. Goodbye. Oh, wow. This was worth it. Door to Eternity makes it so all of your summons can't die for two turns. Huh. Oh. Not even so yours, all summons, period. The, if we talk to the dock workers here, they're standing in a bunch of poison. I bet we can, like, pursue a quest. Uh, related to that. Yeah, supposedly they're- oh, yeah, we gotta go talk to, uh, uh, Magister Raymond. Does everybody oh, this, love him? This dog portrait's really, really squished. Oh, god, that's really weird looking. 
What you looking at? I'm sick here. Okay, Get let's lost. Give it a vig Ask what ails it. Fireball. Your hand upon set. Soulmate is a weird one. Bread of rain. I'll live without it. Slide your hand attack. beneath the studded collar. Oh. Oh. Okay, so we want laser ray, flaming tongue. So. What happened was I was talking with the beggar man and he's like, oh, my dog's sick, please give me money. And I'm like, mm, no. And then I look at the dog and the dog has a collar that is intentionally for injuring it. Oh. Tell the dog that you can heal it. That's pain, pretty fucked up. Must trust you. And the collar inside out. Payment in gold? Uh, <laughs> ask him who put the collar on him. Master did. Ask the dog if he knows what that means. Huh? Uh, wait a minute. Master hurted me? <laughs> Excuse me a minute. I'm going to go now. But first, I have a thing I need to do. <gasps> do you think he's going to kill his master? What do you think? I Maybe. Know. I think he's going to give him a hug. to his master. Uh, Peas on him. You bad man, you! <laughs> just barked at him. He just barked and ran. I think that's a recycled Labrador picture from the last game. Uh, <laughs> yes, except for I think they changed the eyes, but it could be wrong. I don't remember the eyes being that big and doughy. So I, I, look, I look forward to using Dominate Mind. If we get if we get rid of someone's <laughs> magic armor, I can control them for two turns. <laughs> the the best this is easy, a enough. classy beggar. So the dog yeah. runs away. Now he says, "Penny for a grieving beggar whose dog ran away." <laughs> uh, so I got somebody to talk to. Sure. If you guys want to check it out. Okay. Nice. Yeah. Oh, that's the guy that I had heard about. Is he the white magister? Yeah, he's the white magister. Yeah. Go on, you mute sacks of flesh. Put your backs into it. I'll not lose another day to the tide. The Lord Dread awaits. It sails billow with Dallas's breath. Oh. The Magister stops barking orders. He sniffs the air like a predator, turns to face you, the wolf eyeing the deer. He's level 12, by the way. <laughs> Assume an air of levity and say you didn't realize you smell so bad. Oh, but yours is not a stink like the one that surrounds us, spat from a dying sea. Yours is a scent that invites a question. Are you single? Tell me, have you ever been strung up by the hands? Your body swinging like a bell's clapper as your bones are being broken with cast iron rods? Yeah. Uh, say it doesn't impress you. You've seen worse done to runaway slaves. Oh, but you're a slave too, lizardling. A slave to source, hmm? Just like the rest of your heathen kind. He licks his lips. Dry flesh turns wet. See, I'd like to string you up too. Rack you with rods and leave you dangling over a puddle of your own blood and piss. Cross your arms and say you've had quite enough of this. What's his game? My favorite one. I'm very good at what I do, see. I don't even need a sauce hound yapping by my side. There was a whiff of something in the air when you approached. A current of filth. That is to say, source. Best convince me I was mistaken. <laughs> Let's see. I wish I knew what my stats were. Uh... Huh. It's supposed to also be motivated by how feasible the actual answer is. Yeah, so either you're a bounty hunter that kills people with source and therefore you smell like source, or I, okay. if you say if you say the whole Dallas thing, he'll yeah. be like, "Well, Dallas doesn't have a nose quite like mine," and then. Ooh, I like strength though. Right. Take a step closer and whisper. He has a lot of nerve to accuse the best source hunter west of Arcs of being a sorcerer. That's a Persian good one, success. yeah. Success! He leans in closer and sniffs the air once more. Interesting. 
So I was mistaken. Must have been ambition I smelled on you, not the magic that dare not speak its name. Oh yeah, I can pull up my, my inventory. What was my strength? 14. Eh, memory is my strong point, but whatever. Very well. In that case, we'll forego the gallows and turn straight to the hunt. The very definition of your order's existence. Seems peaceful here, doesn't it? A quiet day in a quiet town. One wouldn't think these drifting woods toss on dwarf-troubled waters. But they do. Say you're intrigued. Inquire after these dwarven troubles. Consider for a moment the dwarf. What is he? A mule, a beast of burden. But some defy that role. There are rats among them, dancing to their rat queen's tune. I've need of a rat catcher. Urge him to... M Motherfucker. Hmm? Josh. Oh, did the game... Oh, it crashed on his end. Aww. Did it really? Yep. <laughs> How late... How We're having a lot of problems today. Saved. Yeah. First a weird duping glitch, then multiple crashes, and like, game's just losing its mind. That's the thing. I wonder if he's like only partially void, woken, evil, polluted magic. I don't know. Also, all the fish here are malformed. I was talking with the fishermen, or the people that were trying to sell fish, and the fish had tumors and flaky scales and sometimes multiple heads. Yuck. Delicious. Gross. Ultimately, you're just going to have to love Peepers for exactly who he is. <laughs> I really want to try my... Uh, Dull, well, bone. I want to try my laser beam. I want to try to possess somebody and make them my team. Well, I, looks the looks arena like we sounds saved, like it's going to be a great place for us to looks like we destroy people while dealing right with before dog. the dialogue. Oh, wait. Uh, did you? Okay. Um, the characters need to be switched to. Yeah, working on that. I'm looking Shell, at just need to get in. I'm looking yep. at Shell's disheveled bar. Hey. Pretty bad. I don't leave <gasps> spaces. Oh, it's, my be it's beautiful. What did you do? I'm all right. When I start casting I Dominate Mind, I go like much. pure pink and purple neon and everything. You're safe among <laughs> friends. Never forget it. Watch Wander go through his dialogue with the guy again, and the second time he doesn't believe him about being a I bounty mean, hunter. That'd be uh, sad. And we fight him, I guess. Fight? Oh. Well, wouldn't the whole town turn on us, or people not Usually really care not. About him? And he might be alone. He had one I'm silent in. monk with him, at least. I can, I yep. can cast Dominate Mind on Peeper. <gasps> hey. <that's fine. laughs> okay. Well, I hope it uh, doesn't. Did you talk to the dog? Don't think about it too much. Yes. The dog's gone. Okay. Yeah. Yep, dog's gone. Okay, the dog's, dog's gone. gone. <laughs> <laughs> I I said that yesterday, uh, not yesterday, a couple days ago, and one of you, one of you guys started cracking up, but I don't remember. Oh well. I mean, we do that me. reference like every day. My fave. I'm very. There was a w best convinced me I was. He leans in. Interested. Very well. Seems p but they okay. do. Consider for a I've need of a... Of course. Do you remember where you okay, left off? I again. must depart yeah. post yeah, haste. Jesus. But Julian here will stay behind and be a good little parrot. Ask and he will answer. I actually forgot to record this. I'm going to have to reread it. I'm sorry. But of course... Uh, <laughs> so this is, I think, post crash. Of course I must depart post haste. But Julian here will stay behind and be a good little parrot. Ask and he will answer. Stay behind? But I've my orders, same as you, Dallas. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, Julian is staying, and with that, I must be off. No hard feelings about the death threats, of course. How about we part shaking hands instead of stringing them up? Shake his hand and say you'll look into the troubles with the dwarves. How very heartwarming. One last thing. The Magisters here are diligent men and women. 
A stranger like you may run into... troubles with them. Should this happen, just wave this piece of parchment in their eager little faces. My signature will placate them without fail, I assure you. Ooh. Adieu and good luck. The Lord Dread awaits. The use of the gallows, I pass on to you. You did it, Wander. You beat racism forever. It's over now. Get on board and man your stations. I cannot wow. wait until I can set that man on fire <laughs> repeatedly. <laughs> but he just gave us something to to possibly get the lizard lady out and everything. It doesn't make him yeah. a good person. Like yeah. Uh, no, it doesn't make him a good person. I'm just saying that. Alrighty. We, we uh, wrap this up here. Yeah, I was going to finish talking to Julian. Okay. And then cool. we'll we'll wrap it. Or... Okay. So the magister is rubbing the dirt off his robes. None the worse for wear, apparently, for from the blast of magic that knocked him off his feet. You! The supposed source hunter! I'd be whining and dining aboard the Lord Dread if it weren't for you! Your meddling in magister affairs had better be worth it! Insist he quit blubbering. Such behavior does not suit a man of his stature. A man of stature wouldn't be moored on a dock with no one but dead fish for company. But here I am and here you are. So, to business. Now answer me. Did you meet with a magister caravan on your way into town? The hour was growing late and I'm beginning to worry something might have gone wrong. Yup. By the bishop's bones, you saw it! Out with it, man! What happened? Uh, tell him you came across a caravan east of town. It was destroyed by Voidwoken. Voidwoken? That means source was used. Which means some third party must have attacked first. And I've a fair idea who that might have been. Raymond, that old goat, always suspected there's more to the Driftwood Dwarves than meets the eye. Hate to admit it, but I think he may be right. Too many things have gone wrong along Reaper's Coast to attribute to bad luck. Magister ship sinking, weapons disappearing, and as you've seen, a caravan attacked and destroyed. Rumor has it the Dwarvian Queen herself is behind these acts of sabotage. That is what I want you to prove. Say that if you're to prove these accusations, you have, you have to know where to start looking. There's a local thug, Lohar. He runs an operation out of his hideout beneath the Black Bull Tavern. I suspect this man of being a spy for his queen. It may be interesting to have a word with him, find out what he's up to. But where I really want you to ferret around is Reaper's Bluffs, to the east of Driftwood. It says Wes. <laughs> it's wild what? territory, remote and hostile, where I believe the dwarves may have set up a base of operations away from prying eyes. Should you find any such place, and better yet, proof that Lohar is working in behalf of Queen Justinia, you will be handsomely rewarded, I assure you. So you probably know enough for now. In that case, go forth and let the hunt commence! Yeah. Well, there we go. Now we're running around with the title oh, of Source no, Hunter fine. again. Yeah. <laughs> Pretending, at least. Full circle! Full <laughs> circle! No possible negative consequences for this. I'm going to leave town and cast some of these spells. <laughs> uh, hey, Keith, can you actually follow me? I want to see if, uh... uh -oh. <laughs> I, I want to see if Dominate Person works on me. Because I wonder if Dominate Person could be used to, like, supersede uh, Mind Control from other spells. Well, they have to be non-allied. Oh, okay, yeah. never mind then. Well, I guess I'm just going to go blow up some chicken corpses then. <laughs> 